Hey Leo, Salt Intuition Tarot here. This is your reading. I have a message for you from Spirit. It's nature. This is a time to absorb the healing properties that nature has to offer. Your mind, body, and soul need nourishment, energy, revitalization, and strength. Nature has much to offer, so take this time to connect and spend some quality time outdoors. Yippee! It's all I needed here. How about you? I'll be glad to get outside. All right, Leo. We'll see what you need to know. See what's going on with Leo. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. Give it three shuffles. One, two, three. What's going on for Leo? Have goodbyes post belong. So is somebody saying goodbye. What's going on, Leo's? What does Leo need to know? Ten of Wands. The end. Try not to have so many burdens. But you're unsatisfied. Of course you are. You're Leo. You're not satisfied. Doesn't matter what you do. <laughs> Looks like the universe offering you love. You're rejecting it. Because you got some burdens. Wheel of Fortune's here. Big signs. Just take it shit day by day, right? Hermit. Maybe going ghost. Maybe you're not around a lot of people. Maybe you like to think about things a lot before you try to do anything. Y'all in your head. Uh, Virgo energy. Doing things alone. Trying to shine a light to what path you're going to be on. What's going on? Woo! Toxic. Some of y'all coming off a toxic path. Dealing with a Capricorn. Could be. Capricorn doesn't have to be a toxic Capricorn. This is a Capricorn card, okay? Could be a Capricorn in the mix. And the Empress. The Capricorn and the Empress. What a pair. What's going on with this individual? If you are dealing with a Capricorn or a Taurus, Libra, Empress, or someone that thinks you're the Empress, what's going on? Chariot. Moving on or moving toward. What are we doing? Cancer energy. Ooh, heartbreak in this situation. Maybe it caused a heartbreak. Heartbreak. Moving. Might be moving out of heartbreak. But it looks like you move toward heartbreak. Let's hope that ain't the case. Y'all take it as it resonates. What you gonna do now? Somebody wanted to win at all costs. Uh, never letting things go. Maybe disagreements or uh, some kind of conflict. Somebody in the situation wanted to win at all costs. Want to be victorious over a situation. Last man standing. Five of swords energy. And walking away from love. That's for some of y'all. We can see what else is out there. Those can be reversed. Sorry about my dogs. Did see the mini regrets card. Let's see what's going on. Person on your mind, how they feel about you. How they feel about Leo. Person on your mind. There was a tower moment with the Emperor. Things were not built on a firm foundation, so that, therefore, it is a rocky situation. Somebody thinks it's not a firm foundation. Uh, offering love to someone else. Could be offering love to someone else because... And the love offer, they think it was uh, built on shaky ground. 
You'll get communications of this with the Eight of Wands. And they're going to communicate what's their future actions toward you. Besides the communication, nobody's doing shit. Eight of Pentacles. Sideways means it's happening right now. Ain't nobody doing nothing. Should be working hard on something, but ain't nobody doing nothing. Queen of Wands is here. Fire sign. Here you go. Could be a Sagittarius or Aries individual. Focusing on their money. Wanting a happy home life. Drinks on me. Right? Somebody may be over drinking. Who knows? Over celebrating, having patience, trying not to be immature, but the death of being immature and having some patience with an immature person. Could be, could deal with a Scorpio that is uh, acting childish. You need to have patience. You will end up happy. They will get their happy back. If you're dealing with a Scorpio. Or they see happiness with you. Hmm. Also have another page. Offer stability. Maybe get an offer from an earth sign for stability. Tars, Leo, Capricorn. Not Leo, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What the hell? But there's going to be some conflict going on. Some competition. Maybe they see there's competition, conflict. What happened in this situation? Maybe you've had conflict uh, over stability. Somebody not sharing, holding things close to their chest. Uh, not wanting to express themselves, show their emotions. The moon's here. Might be things you don't know. They're not telling you. Earth sign. So, y'all be aware of earth signs. Keep things close to their chest. Maybe it might piss you off. <laughs> if the fighting, the reason why you're in conflict. All right. Let's move forward. Let's see. Uh... How do they see you? How do they see you? They see you want to end the conflict. If you're in conflict with somebody, they see that you want to end the conflict and that you do want an equal give and take, that you do want love and happiness and offer your cup to someone. But you're all in your head. Look at these swords. Nine of swords, eight of swords, nine of swords, slowly trying to get out of your head so that you can have a love in your life, Leo. The world, you can have the world. Take it day by day. I guess we need to know on the world card. The world card. The world card. Uh, we've got climbing the ladder of success. Then you got somebody coming in for sex. <laughs> somebody wants to climb your ladder for some sex. Uh, just saying. I mean, look at this. This is the king of wands. Sexual person. This could be a fire sign. Seeing you climb the ladder of success. Stay all up in your ladder and don't even know the flavor. <laughs> Kool Aid. We have Wheel of Fortune and the Hermit. And here we go. Somebody may be a Capricorn you're dealing with. Uh, could be in Hermit mode and hoping for better days. Capricorn's coming out. So you may be dealing with Capricorn. Just saying. This could be obsession, obsessively being in hermit mode and waiting for better days. Other than people wanting sex and uh, watching you have success. Or wanting to be successful in sex. How about that? 
What in the world, Leo? Which is wisdom? See what the witches have to say. Which is wisdom card? Let's see what's going on for Leo. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. What do we need to know? We have passion, fire, passion, lights. What's going on with this passion card? What are you passionate about, Leo? Somebody could have passion for you. In the summertime, you're going to have some passionate things going on in the summertime. Rut row. That's the summer card. Security. In the witch's cottage. So, uh, maybe somebody come to you house for some passion. <laughs> What is it, Leo? What is it about this, Leo? Somebody want to come to your house? Be passionate with you. All right. Let's get some Alice in Wonderland. Let's see what Alice needs to tell you. What do you need to know? What's some advice for Leo? Leo. Going on for Leo. We have clock time, time pressure in a rush. So don't get in a rush. So, yeah, slow down. Can't tell Leo that. So probably need to just slow down a little bit. And no need to fear. Remember how powerful you are. Get the power and the strength. Anything else we need to tell Leo before we go? What does Leo need to know before we go? We have never jammed today. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Promises that never come to be. Empty words. Not living in, in the now. So let's live in the now. Let's not think about what everybody's promised. You know, promise a lot of people don't keep. So... Let's keep our promises, okay? Promise somebody something, let's do it. All right, with the promise card. All right, y'all, that you're reading. Like, share, comment, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, oh, we should do so now. Hit the like button.